hey guys welcome back to my channel so in this video we're gonna see how to take effective meat and find the aesthetic notes so first of all let me show you guys the book that i use this book is really great for note taking though you know it bleeds when i use the brush pen so hard but yeah it's fine because the notebook is great next step i'm going to show you guys the pens that i use first camlin brush pens for highlighting decorating editing i use these pens and then um, uniball pen and then stick pen and a metallic pen so first you need to choose a color for your chapter as you're going to have color coded chapters so for this chapter i've chose pink you can choose whatever chapter you, i mean whatever color you want for a particular chapter so first of all you need to write the heading neat and bold you, you don't have to be so great in calligraphy like i'm not great in calligraphy the metallic pen would give you that aesthetic look even without a neat calligraphy work you can just write in bold letters that would be you know okay next step i'm just using my black pen to write the heading the the subheading whatever it follows in the chapter and then i'm just using my color which is pink for this chapter to highlight the heading next step what you have to do is just scheme through the chat i mean the scheme through the topic whichever you're going to start taking note with so take time to scheme through it so that you would get an idea of which to mark as important what are the key points stuff like that so first you need to scheme to the topic after that you're going to write in points and the important thing is you're going to write in your own words so you have to write in your own words that's like the most important thing in taking notes if you're going to just copy the paragraphs from your textbook it's of no use So then, that's the subheading, which have just stroked with a line. You you can get awesome headers, ideas from Pinterest. Next, I'm gonna write the points in my own words. So while writing, you got to read the topic once again. So first, we scheme through the topic. which would give us a idea of it and then we are going to read it once again so that we get the points out now i'm just continuing the same thing again this then moving to the next topic and you're going to write the key words in the color pen that you have chose for the chapter As I've chose pink for this chapter, I'm using my pink stick pen to write the key word. Like that, you have to use whatever pen you, I mean, whatever color you want to write the key words. It's really important to color code the key words so that while you revise through the chapter, you would see the words and find out the definition. I'm using the arrows to write the points which would give it a neat look. You can even use bullet points and whatever you want. Then when you are drawing the diagrams make sure you draw them neatly and put them inside a box 
so that it makes the notes look much more neater After I finish taking my notes I would just go through it once again so that I would get a good idea about the chapter and the important stuff that I should learn then after that after 2 to 3 days I would come back to my notes and then revise them once again and at that time while I revise I would mark the very important stuff with my red pen So it's really important to mark the importance so that when you don't get time to learn the whole chapter you can just go through the importance but just going through the important topics you can actually get an idea of the simpler simpler terms and stuff which should be in the important topic and which should make it easier to learn so while i study I would first start studying the importance like the very importance that I have marked then I would go to the simpler 2 3 2 or 3 marks definitions and stuff like that after finishing the definitions I would go for the diagram for biology I'm saying I would go back and then check on to the diagrams that I should learn Now I'll just show you guys my chemistry notes and I'll tell you guys how I study chemistry. So for chemistry what I do is first I would study the terms like the definitions the two or three marks later on I would move to the five mark questions and the derivations and later on i would go to the equations which are very important first i would study the equations which are very important so you can see i put equations inside a box so that it would look neat like the diagrams so first i would study the very important equations later on i would go on to the equations which are not so important so for highlighting the points or the keywords you can use the same brush pen or you can use a highlighter i used to use the cello pastel colored highlighters now i forgot to take it so i'm just using the brush pen that's how i take easy and effective aesthetic notes thank you so much for watching please do like if you like the video or dislike if you don't please subscribe and click the bell icon next to it so that you'd get notified whenever i upload a video thank you so much for watching bye